It's not just about driving, is it, Andrew? No, it's not just about driving. <laughs> what else have you got to do? I'm going to make the tea. I'm going to make sure that I don't, I don't do anything silly. I behave myself in the paddock as well. That's quite important. Mark's told me about that. And uh, but make it look all shiny. During the season, Andrew will benefit from the expert advice of double clear cup champion Paul Vidal. Paul has been monitoring Andrew's progress in the first session and is helping him get the best out of the track in the wet conditions. If Andrew is to improve, he must listen to everything Paul is telling him. Something a scholarship winner must always do. You've got to get on that front row and run through again, don't they, really? And that's one thing that you've got to get into your driving style. Okay? It's that bit of, at the moment, when it's wet out there, you're slowing the car up enough and have performance obviously that's fine as plenty of but you've got to start picking that throttle up slightly earlier and I'm minding the steering lock. I'm getting you on split times for instance through paddock as well as doing the split yeah. time. And the guys that were, you were equal with on the in the braking area at yeah. the same time, you're losing to every single one of them on the exit. Right. So you're just not getting on that power and unwinding the road early enough. There's a couple of times I went through paddock and I was taking more speed for it and it's like the back was yeah. On or off the I was, I was kind of feeding the pair on. Okay, so you, therefore, if you start to, if you'd have fed that in earlier on, you'd have had a bit far more stable than that. Okay, because the swap gives the car stability. When you accelerate, the back of the car comes down and sits yeah. to the ground, okay? Yeah. When you're not on the throttle, the back of the car is light and it wants to stay around it on a hard throttle, okay? So all the time you're doing that, you're creating problems for yourself, okay? Yeah. You're losing your exit speed and you're making the car unsettled for the second corner. Yeah, absolutely. So if you're on the power earlier, you, as you go, the back of the car, it then comes down. So as you accelerate, the back comes down. Therefore, there's more weight transfer to the wheel, more grip at the wheel. Yeah. Okay? So therefore, if you can just get out of the top of the top, it's the second practice session, so let's see if Andrew's listened to Paul. Fingers crossed. after the break at a wet and cold Brands Hatch.